Hi, and welcome to the Best Buy Vlog. My name is Ray, and in this video, I'll be reviewing the Breville Barista Touch Impress Espresso Machine. Before we get started, I have to make this pun. This machine is so impressive. It is so impressive. It is a work of art. You're gonna love it. Breville's Barista line ships with a ton of removable parts and accessories, so let's get right into what's in the box. You'll find an integrated grinder, tamp, tamp cover, steam wand, and hot water outlet, as well as a removable 340 gram floated plastic bean hopper with a removable silicone lid that helps seal in the freshness of your beans. On the rear, there's a 2 liter removable plastic water tank with removable water filter and water filter holder. Um, and then in the front, there's a removable drip tray with a removable drip tray cover in that same beautiful, like sparkling stainless steel. Behind the drip tray, there's a hidden removable cleaning toolbox. If you purchase one of these machines and you're setting it up, make sure you pull out your drip tray because that cleaning toolbox is tucked away back there. It won't get wet or anything like that during use. It is made to store things, um, but it's kind of like a little secret. So I'm rinsing some of my machine parts now and I'm just going to go ahead and pre-soak that water filter. You'll also find included a quick start guide, product manual, warranty information, a stainless steel milk jug, um, your porter filter, four different filter baskets, a single cup, single wall, um, a, a single with a dual wall, a double shot single wall, and a double shot dual wall. Um, in the cleaning toolbox, you'll find the razor, Breville stainless steel precision dose trimming tool, and then for cleaning tools, Breville also includes two cleaning tablets, an Allen key, a cleaning tool for the steam wand tip, cleaning disc, um, a packet of descaling powder, and finally, a water hardness test strip. As its name implies, the Breville Barista Touch does more than just pull espresso shots. For starters, it's going to walk you through the entire setup process on that little screen. This espresso machine is a do-it-all device with an integrated guide. You can use it to warm your mugs, make espresso, make coffee drinks, steam four different kinds of milk, three of them non-dairy, and even make a cup of tea. It features a full color touchscreen, which I'm using right here, and its presets include espresso, lattes, flat whites, cappuccinos, americanos, hot chocolate, baby chinos, tea, and steamed milk or just microphone. The way that the touch impress works is pretty cool. So the touch screen breaks down the steps for every drink that it knows how to make, and then it lets you fine tune within each drink to fit your exact preferences. For instance, um, in this post I'm going to, sorry, in this video I'm going to pre-warm a cup, I'll make some tea, I'm making an Americano, I'm making a latte, I'm going to ice that latte, and for every single one of those I can customize things like the size of my drink, how many shots I want it, um, even the temperature that the drink is going to come out at. I'm going to talk a little bit about this product while I make drinks in the background, so right now I'm going to pull a shot of espresso and then I'm going to make an Americano, and finally I'm going to make an iced latte. And you can kind of watch along to see what can be customized and how those steps work when the machine is guiding you through them. The way that the touch works is pretty cool. All of Breville's touch products work kind of like this, but the Impress has like the latest and greatest of all of the technologies. This touch screen breaks down the steps for every single drink that it knows how to make, and then you can fine tune them to fit your exact preferences or the preferences of like a guest or something like that. So, for instance, to make a latte, you first customize your espresso shot. You tell the barista the filter size you want to use, double or single walled, how big you want your drink to be, how hot you want it to be, what grind size you're using. And then when you tap the icon of the portafilter, the barista grinds your fresh beans directly into it. And then you tap using the integrated lever. Barista products recommend tamping twice for the perfect tamp if you're using the integrated one. And then if your portafilter is still a little low on grounds, as mine was a couple of times, you'll keep tapping that icon and re-tamping until the dose is exactly perfect. The Impress upgrades what Breville was already working with in previous models in the Barista line. It adds improved precision 22 pound tamping, intelligent puck dosing using the new Impress puck system, and a quicker thermojet heating system, which heats up super fast. It also has a larger bean hopper than previous products, and it adds auto milk spelled M-I-L, capital Q, which is a new system um, for Breville's steam wand. Auto milk calibrates for three alternative milk settings along with regular dairy from cow's milk. So you choose dairy, almond, oat, or soy, and then from there, 
you can further customize. So for instance, if you're customizing your milk foam, you can set it not only for what kind of milk you're using, but also the foam level that you want. Do you want it like just hot milk or do you want it really, really foamy? I like it really foamy. Um, and then you also choose your temperature. So if you want it like piping hot, you can go for that. If you want it something that's kid friendly, for instance, what Breville uses in their baby Chino, you can go as low as I think 45 degrees for just like a nice warm, but not too hot milk. I didn't need my steam one for my first two drinks, which was that first shot of espresso that I pulled and then the Americano that you see on the left here. Um, I just added a little milk to that by hand, which is exactly how I like it. But right now I'm making a latte and of course I will have to use that steam wand. Breville's Touchline is the brand's flagship product line for smart coffee making. And the Barista Touch Impress is like really the creme de la creme of that category. These products come equipped with those full color touch screens and they're great for so many different things. If you love to host a lot of parties, this is awesome because if someone likes to drink a cup of coffee that you don't usually drink yourself, it'll show you exactly how to do it. If you're learning how to pull a great cup of coffee and you know you don't want to go to classes every Saturday, you just want to learn from the comfort of your kitchen, great, like Breville's got you covered. It'll even troubleshoot drink by drink for you. So let's say you pull a shot of espresso and the machine goes, mm, you know, that pulled a little too fast. I think it's going to be kind of sour. You'll get a little prompt and it'll say, you know, that was a really fast pull do you want to do another shot of espresso? Here's how you could change it. Or, you know, do you like how it tastes? Are you happy with this result? Because I can remember that for the future. Um, it is also, and I think this is my last one, really excellent if you have multiple people living in the same household. So if one partner gets up in the morning and has a shot of espresso, you can use the exact same machine later in the day to make a latte and the exact same machine that evening to make a little baby chino for your kid and a cup of tea with no caffeine in it. For more on the Breville Barista Touch Impress, make sure to check out my full review at the Best Buy blog because this is one that I really think you should keep your eye on. It's a great product. Thanks so much for watching and have a good one.